Yep. Hey, it's Aaron from GameThrough.com, and we're looking at the Escapists for the Xbox One. We'll talk about the PC version, but I haven't played it. So how Escapists works is uh, you're on one of six prisons, and you, you guessed it, you want to escape, believe it or not. So, um, if what I've seen on television and... Uh, heard through through conversations is uh, more so television. It's true. Um, you follow a, a pretty uh, pretty strict routine in jail. So you start every day off with the roll call, which is a good time to talk to fellow uh, inmates and take on side missions, also known as favors in this game. And then every day, like clockwork, literally. Uh, I don't know if he's literally right. Whatever. Um, you you go to roll call, you go to breakfast, and you'll see what else happens throughout the day. So uh, eating meals are a good way to re uh, revive your vitality, which is in the upper uh, left corner. And your health is the heart. So eating, and if you exercise, things like that, and you can get better. You can also pick up items from uh, befallen, uh, befallen inmates. He's okay. And, and, and Tom, he'll be fine in, in a little while. So, And guards will see you. Yeah, he's coming at me. If you look at me. Look in the upper right. You'll see a meter that uh, shows how much money I have and I guess how much heat I have with the guards. So that heat can be generated by doing things they don't want you to do, like taking items off of a recently beaten inmate, fighting other inmates, fighting guards, so on and so forth. Um, during your free period, you can do things like visit people who normally really tell you a whole lot or you can spend money um, at the payphone and buy tips sometimes the tips are useful well most times are useful the people I find the people that, that come to visit you don't really give you any good information or you can do what I did and improve your intelligence by laughing out loud at cats on the internet I mean that's it's been scientifically proven to make anyone smarter I'm, I'm, you know the, the, this game is realistic why wouldn't it work here okay so that's your free period you have lunch and you do your job. A job you begin with by default. As far as I can, as far as I know, in my experience, I did play a lot of this game. Uh, is uh, the laundry. The laundry. So you take on the monumental task of pulling dirty clothes out of a bin, putting them into a washing machine, waiting for the washing machine to ding and glow. Like a, that kind of plutonium cartoony kind of glow. You know, the healthy kind. And you put it into a, a blue bin. Bam. After that, it's an exercise. So you pump that iron, get on that treadmill. And this can't actually uh, increase your... It decreases your uh, your stamina or whatever because you're exercising. But overall, it will make you stronger. You'll have more health the more you exercise. You can exercise during your free time. You don't have to only do it during the mandated exercise time. Much like roll call in the morning and in the evening. Uh, the shower time... For whatever reason, even with four guards standing there, maybe even five, is a good time to walk around. And the exclamation points over the inmates' heads means they have a favor. Uh, the yellow bag, pulsating bag, with a heart in it, means that they have things they can sell you. So you're in the pause menu, you can look at your journal, and look at your favors, which are things that you've already agreed to do for people. Uh, steal things from other inmates, beat up other inmates, beat up guards. The notes are things you know how to do. So if you buy a tip from the phone it will go into your notes section so you don't have to remember you can just go back there and look at it for review and how to craft it things there is a, a crafting system in the game and um you play your cards right and get things done you can eventually escape believe it or not with plastic utensils but other things have to happen before that it just doesn't work like you know you, you have to kind of plan things out advance. I'm not going to read into that. So, you escape. I like that TV show kind of music they added in there. I like that. That's good. 
and you move on to the next prison. I will fully admit right now, I am not as far along in this game as I would have liked to have been. This game was very challenging. Uh, I enjoyed it. It's one of those things where it benefits from the whole like schoolyard. Hey, did you try this? You try this. And if he, knowing somebody who's playing, I mean, yes, you can watch YouTube videos, which I admit I, I did do. Um, so you can watch YouTube videos and figure things out. But it's more fun to find someone else who's playing it and you share your experiences. And oh, did you try this? Did you try this? Did you know that you can cut through this with a knife? Did you know that if you take, you know, two pillows and a pillowcase, you can make a bed dummy? I'm not, I'm not sure that's what I, what I used to make it, but so yeah. You also get fired from your job. I did that many times. I didn't realize that I needed to take like a rake or a hole or whatever and walk around and kind of clean up, you know, clean up the weeds. It's like an Animal Crossing kind of thing. But you still follow a similar routine in different jails. Um, methods to escape come with uh, come with risks, uh, consequences like getting shot and ending up in the infirmary and missing out on some of your free period. If you do get fired, you can get hired back, as you can see. Um, so that's good. Oftentimes you have to wait like a day before they'll kind of hire you back. But you know, that, that's that's not bad for getting fired, I guess. And you see, you can't if you if you try to search people's cells, the guards will get at you. The game is really about just trying different things and seeing what works. Like right now, I'm giving hips an uh, item that I thought he wanted, and because people's moods about you change how they interact with you. He doesn't want it, so I got the thumbs down. Despite him asking me to do that. That's just how the game is. So you'll be well along thinking, I'm doing this favor for this person, and then they'll be mad at you because maybe you beat someone up that was a friend of theirs, or whatever. Sometimes you'll be successful. Like taking sleeping pills from Jack, and giving them to Isaac. Those kind of favors are risky, but these are riskier. The ones where you have to create a diversion. They work out right then. Yeah, I got the money for it, but now my heat with the, the COs is high. I might have made more enemies amongst my fellow inmates. So I found it was better to do things that allow me to stay a little more neutral. Then I found out, hey, if an officer's knocked out, you can take all their stuff. Yeah, that doesn't work out too well. They're following me. And yeah, I ended up in solitary. So escapist is kind of whatever you put into it. You put a lot of time into it. You have a lot of fun, uh, a lot of trial and error. It's best to find someone to play the game with, to share things with. It's fun, but it's certainly not for everyone. I enjoyed my time with it and hope to play some more.